What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Hey guys, and welcome back. Well, congratulations are in order for Prince Harry and actress Meghan Markle. They are officially engaged. Kensington Palace announced today. The prince reportedly popped the question earlier this month. Now, Prince Harry has informed Her Majesty the Queen and other close members of his family Prince Harry has also sought and received the blessings of Miss Markle's parents, the royal family said in a state. Now, Prince Harry has the blessings of his parents, Queen Elizabeth II and her husband, the Duke of Edinburgh, are delighted for the couple and wish them every happiness. Now, uh, Meghan's parents are equally excited. In a statement released by the Kensington Palace on their behalf, they said, We are incredibly happy for Meghan and Harry. Our daughter has always been a kind and loving person. To see her union with Harry, who shares the same qualities, is a source of great joy for us as parents. We wish them a lifetime of happiness and very excited for their future together. Now, the royal couple are set to marry in the spring of 2018. You know, I I also wish them a lifetime of happiness, but I've been keeping up. I don't know if you have been keeping but I found racist articles attacks uh, Prince Harry and his girlfriend. Now, uh, Meghan Markle is a biracial her mother is black, her father is white, and she grew up in South Central LA. And uh, it looks like ever since the world uh, found out about him, uh, they've got a kick out of learning the prince was dating a quote black actress. But it seems not everybody approves of their reported union. Now, instead of celebrating, the British press is making attempts to smear Megan's good name by playing up the usual stereotypes that unfortunately come along with being black. Now, just yesterday, the Daily Mail published an exclusive article that all but said Marco is a ghetto black girl getting a free ride out of Compton. Now, the article was entitled Exclusive. Harry's girl is almost straight out of Compton, gang-scarred scar home of her mother reveals. So, will Prince be dropping for over for tea? <laughs> now, the site continues to fasten Marco to a crime and street gang riddled area of L.A. by pointing out her mom still lives in their old neighborhood, adding Crenshaw has endured 47 crimes in the past week. Now, what that has to do with Megan, I don't know, unless somehow she committed those crimes. It should have never been mentioned. Uh, <laughs> you know, now Daily Mail continued to say, but social worker Raglan, which is uh, Megan's mother, now finds herself welcoming a royal guest to down a trodden Crenshaw after Prince Harry has revealed to be dating her daughter. Suits actress Megan Markle. Megan, 35, is now based in Toronto, Canada, but her mom remains in L.A. 
and moved to her modest green painted home five years ago after the death of her own father, Alvin, in 2011. Now, then stop there. They go on to say Markle was brought up in a large yellow colored detached home in central LA, while her rumored royal boyfriend has spent much of his childhood between Kensington Palace and Prince Charles Mansion, Highgrove. But Harry's literally palatial homes couldn't be more different from the tatty one story homes that dominate much of Crenshaw. Now, you know, if she would have been not had a black mother, would they have been talking about where she's from? And, you know, his mother, Prince Diana, she was poor. She wasn't uh, born with a silver spoon in her mouth. And then uh, Daily Mail goes on to say, and while there have been a total of 21 crimes in the immediate area around Highgrove over the past 12 months, 47 have taken place in Crenshaw in the last week alone, including murder and robbery. Hmm. Now, the Guardian has also called attention to a British press, natural skills for making Markle seems less than appropriate date for a royal prince. Writing in this article, British press have a different approach. They have made it clear that her relationship with Harry is scandalous for a number of reasons. One, she is divorced. Two, she is older than Prince Harry. Markle is 35. Prince Harry is 32. She's played raunchy scenes in the U.S. TV series Suit. And four, hold your hat, sit down. Her mother is visibly black with dreadlocks. Now, isn't this wild? This is just crazy. This is, this is, this is disturbing. Now, they're associating this girl with where she was brought up to live. Like, you know, she's, like they said, she's not appropriate. It's scandalous. Because of these four things that she can't change no more than anyone else can change. And come on. It's scandalous because her mother is black. <laughs> I mean, if I was reading a newspaper article in 1960s, you know, I, I might not be alarmed. But come on, guys. 2017. You know... I wish for a better, a better tomorrow, but I don't know. Racism is always there to raise its ugly head. And it keeps going like that um, Energizer Bunny. It keeps going and going and going. But, well, for my two cents, I hope Prince Harry... And uh, Megan Markle uh, live to a wondrous life together, and and uh, doesn't seem like uh, these racist articles are hurting them one bit. They continue to be in love, and I hope they will always be in love. All right, that's all from me. Let me hear your comments. As always, thank you for watching my video. I hope you will like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And as always in parting, be blessed, y'all. Bye. What we do here is go back, 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 back.